this is Livinho and I'm coming to you from a bus station uh, on my way to work. Something that I don't really want to do at the moment but I have to because you know <laughs> money. I, I wanted to talk to you guys because I'm alone. I am usually am alone and I think some people are staring at me from over there so I'm just gonna continue. Hopefully you can hear me because there's like a poop ton of traffic. I'm feeling a bit poopy because this boy that I used to like right up until like a week or two ago who works with me and I've liked him for a year and two months so it's been like a long it feels like a relationship to be honest all that commitment like he was one person it feels really poopy and I realized that he's like not the type of person I thought he was and now I'm back to square one being single well, I guess I was single before, but this is just like makes it worse because I now like we don't really have like a tangible crush, if you know what I mean. Not like I used to touch him, but the fact that like a crush right in front of me rather than like, oh, I have a crush on this person like who's an internet or movie star. And that's the only problem right now. So I've had to get over that, which is hard because I don't like to hear about people from rumors and I always take what I hear with a grain of salt and I obviously don't believe that like as my first choice but at the same time I'm like I realized it like I actually realized it like not only through hearing things from people but like I heard like I've experienced this face to face with this person and he's just like he's very shallow and only likes girls who are like hot and I'm not that so according to him so that was never gonna work and I respect myself way more than that I'm just more than someone who you know has a face and a body and I'm actually have a personality and dreams and things I want to achieve so thank you next um, I'm so grateful for my ex crush but at the same time but at the same time I'll do so much better without him and that's something I just wanted to say. Anyone who's like watching this, who's crushing very hard on a guy or a girl, um, I just want to let you know that you are more than who this crush wants you to be. If they are not good for you, if they won't make you a better person, then they have got to go. Regardless of how uh, cute and amazing they seem and you know talented and kind they seem, they've got to go. So, Here's Liv with no love experience coming to you um, with a bit of experience and help to not get yourself in the same situation I've got myself into, uh, which is still single. But um, I guess I was single all along, so I had myself to be with and I still have myself to be with and I still have my whole self and I've learned a lot. I've got so much love, I've got so much patience. I learned from the pain, turned out amazing. Thank you, Ari, for teaching me all of this, making me realize that I'm a strong, independent woman who need no man. And if, and if I do want a man, it's because I want to, not because I have to or that I'm forced to get a man. So, those people are staring at me right now, and I'm gonna go because I work soon and I have to like mentally prepare myself. This lighting is bomb. Hopefully, you could hear everything I was saying. I'll be uploading more videos in the future and I'm sorry I keep promising that I'm gonna do it on a semi-regular basis and then it never happens because I have so much to do in my life but I want this to be my one of my priorities and I'm gonna work towards it 